Hello guys, so if you're looking to see if you can fix the move the trash this application is damaged problem, then perfect. Stay tuned and I'll show you guys how to fix it. Hello guys, Celeste here, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys do me a big favor, smash the like button down below, hit the subscribe button too. Guys, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm super excited to say that I have got a brand new upgraded theme. Now, I don't know if you guys can see it, I hope you guys appreciate it as well, as much as I do, but um, I just think this new upgrade, this new um, graphics that I have now got, so it is, I, I think it is absolutely amazing. I will leave the in the description down below the link to the, the person that helped me made it, so then if you guys need any graphics for yourselves, then um, be sure to definitely, definitely go, 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 go and check him out. So his name is actually called Adam Pike, um, he was actually referred to me through uh, Mac Warfare, so thank you again Mac Warfare. Um, he did an excellent job. You were 100% right. I will be using him again in the future. But anyway guys, so back to the video. So today I will be showing you guys how to solve the can't be open because it's damaged problem. Okay, so now I know I get a fair few comments. So for example, I might be showing you guys how to download on a Final Cut. Maybe it's um, Logic Pro, maybe it's Motion, maybe it's something else, but whatever it is, and then every now and again, sometimes I get a comment that basically just says, um, it cannot be opened, um, it's damaged, please help. And I think instead of me just replying to every single comment, it's just so much easier if I just show you how to do it, so then it will always be there, and I can always, always refer you back to this video if you guys need it. But alright then guys, without further ado, let's jump straight in. So, whatever it is, grab the application, so in your shoes right now, I want to grab the application for you that is not working, was just not opening, and then I'll grab one too. So for me, I'm actually going to use Logic Pro. So I've just re-downloaded Logic Pro anyway, so it, it's working fine, but I've just redone it just to help you with the, uh, for the sake of the video. So Logic Pro, see, so yeah, I'm trying to open it. Now, for you, this could be whatever. I don't have a clue. Like, for this could be for you, this could be like ScreenFlow. It could be Compressor. It could be Motion. It could be DJ Pro. It could be Logic Pro. It could be Final Cut. Um, I don't know, but w whatever it is, guys, then this is hopefully going to help you solve that problem. So, as you can see here, it basically just says that uh, Logic Pro X is damaged and can't be opened, and you need to move it to trash, alright? So, all you're going to do is literally just go and hit cancel, and it's fine. You don't need to move it to trash. All you're going to do is, I want you to open up your finder window like that, and then I want you guys to go down to applications, like that and put it to the side so then you can find it in a second also once you're here i want you to open up launch pad and scroll across basically just open up terminal now don't panic i know loads of people panic when i mention terminal it's absolutely fine just follow along with me you'll be 100 percent safe so once you're in terminal all you're literally going to do is from here you're just going to type in now do as i do okay so it's x a t t r space hyphen CR, so that, that, that hyphen is a dash, okay, um, and then space again. So, repeat, I'm just going to double say it, so if you were unsure, it's X-A-T-T-R, space, hyphen, C-R, space, and then all you're going to do is, the reason this is open is, it just makes it a bit easier for the next part, all you're doing is you're just grabbing the application that you want to open, the one that you're having the problem with, the one that you're trying to open right now that is currently damaged, literally just grab it, and then drag it in. So if you're doing it for motion, you would drag motion in. If you're doing it for either screen flow, you drag screen flow in. For the sake of the video, mine was actually Logic Pro. So I'm gonna find my Logic Pro like this. Um, like, okay, there's mine. So I'm gonna grab it, I'm gonna drag it over, and I'm gonna go on like that. And then once it's in, I'm gonna hit enter. Okay. And then in a second, I'm gonna get a third line pop out. There we go. That lets me know it is completely finished. I can close out of it now close out of it and now that's all cool I can close out a terminal it's absolutely cool now if I go down into my launch pad and I go out like that and I scroll across and I go to open up for example Logic Pro this is what should happen so now it's absolutely it's working so I'm gonna download later um, I'll do continue and this is it. So now my Logic Pro will open. All right, guys. So hopefully that is something that will help you guys out, resolve that problem. I hope to help you out. If it did, make sure again you guys do me a big favor. Smash like button down below. Hit the subscribe button too. All right, guys. But that is it for me today. Till next time. I'm out.